Today is pool day. footage looks like. Check the stroke out. Got the rope of glasses. Lab six, fifty seconds. All right, just finished the swim. Um, didn't film a whole lot. A lot of people sort of started coming to the pool, so felt kind of awkward to, to film. My excuse was just to uh, look at my swim stroke, which sort of was what I wanted to do. And I was like, yeah, I might as well just make a little video with the gear I got for swimming. Um, you can comment on my swim stroke if you want, if you guys can tell or see it, uh, if you guys are good swimmers historically or anything. But yeah, that's what I have to work with. Um, but gear wise, got a little float actually found it um tried to find an owner didn't happen um and no one's ever like claimed it so didn't know what to do there i think i found it in the parking lot on the ground um i got these paddles get two of them anytime you buy them comes a pair for each hand uh they're sort of i guess help your swim stroke sort of do a little workout uh don't use them too much um i usually maybe do 200 yards my pool is a 25 yard pool. Um, so yeah, just sort of added workout resistance, I guess, and work on how your stroke is. Um, swim cap, like I said, is a game changer. I've had a couple just cause kind of wanted to get some different styles, but currently I'm rocking the TUIR. Um, it's kind of like a camo effect, kind of cool. Um, Figured might as well buy one and make you wear one in the um, in the Ironman. And once I made that transition, it was, like I said, game changing. Um, makes you like a knife in water. Didn't believe it, but yeah, I thought it'd pull on your hair a lot more, um, but it really doesn't. 
um, as long as you like, fill it up with water and then throw it on your head like I probably showed you in the beginning of this video. Um, and goggles. I'm currently, this is my second swim, third swim? Third swim with these Rokas. Um, I'd honestly tell you what the brand exactly like the name is for these but if you know these roca ones that have the big goggles like the x1 or r1 or some these are the one below it these aren't the massive big ones um that help you for uh seeing people better because it's got like a 180 degree view or something like that i don't know but um i found these on ebay for 20 bucks think on their website they're like 39 or 29 so i'd say like 10 bucks just finding someone on ebay and i'm pretty impressed with them they kind of ride right up in here a little bit more so some of my longer swims they still kind of hurt up in here but they don't fog up like some of the nike i think i had some nike ones and um what else i have i think i had some tyrs or whatever they called um and they fogged up no matter what so these hadn't ever fogged up on me during a swim um and i enjoy them um and i'm currently using the roca uh swim shorts <laughs> which I actually just found out your boy is wearing them inside out <laughs> didn't know that so uh <laughs> that's funny but um yeah that's pretty much it nothing nothing else uh you get, get yourself a nice bag got this yeti i think it's the yeti 30 liter it's nice because i can hook my swim bottle or float to it and i have multiple layers of storage for the back and the front so i can separate gear from clothes and i can have my wallet and phones and my ring up here and stuff so get yourself a good good bag you can have a swim bag a mesh bag good for the wet stuff but um the only thing that's wet really is my pants and uh the float everything else i pretty much dry off on a towel so um yeah this is a short and sweet video on uh swimming i did 1500 I did just 1500 my pace was 158 did it in 33 minutes it wasn't crazy because some of it was me filming so some of the pacing sort of went off but um yeah here's my heart rate changes i had a little bit of workout sort of stuff i put in the middle just a little bit higher tempo and got my heart rate pretty much up to like 160 which is pretty wild and these were my zones pretty much stayed in that green and that light blue most of the time well yeah swimming's not that <clears throat> not that interesting pretty hard to film um I try to do about anywhere between 30 and an hour. The swim takes about 40, 40 minutes to 50 minutes. Um, so that's sort of where I'm swimming. Um, been sort of started get, catching a little something, something like some common cold or stuff. So my throat's hurting a little bit. So that's why I just did a chill 30 minutes and didn't want to push it because tomorrow might be even worse. So just wanted to get something in in case I have an off day tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, this is like my third time getting sick, too. Got sick in uh, July. Had COVID in October. First time ever getting COVID. Caught that for, what is it? Now it's the fourth year since COVID. And uh, didn't didn't catch me for four years until this, this year. And then now I got something else. So, but I got my flu shot. Not the COVID shot. Normal flu shot. So, if, I, if I'm getting the flu, at least I haven't gotten prepared. I uh, got a got a cruise coming up so i get to do an ocean swim so i'll probably film that a little bit if i can um do my first you know open swim with some of my gear i might bring on my cruise in coco k uh probably be the only one out there be the first one out there um but yeah like comment subscribe if you care about these type of videos if not whatever this is just sort of a vlog for my train uh yeah Catch you in the next one. Gonna go home. God bless.